And now, News 4 Sports with sports director Brianna Jones. A former Elba title winner will be the next head football coach for the Op Bobcats. You've heard the name Ed Rigby before. Well, he has a new home in Covington County. Today, the Op City Schools Board of Education voted to hire the Laverne head football coach. He's the 29th coach in program history to lead the Bobcats onto the field. His hiring comes just a week after first year Op head coach Matt Brunson chose to return to his former stumping grounds in Baker, Florida. Rigby, husband of Troy women's basketball head coach Shanda, comes to op with nearly 35 years of experience. And now, News 4 Sports with sports director Brianna Jones. A former Elba title winner will be the next head football coach for the Op Bobcats. You've heard the name Ed Rigby before. Well, he has a new home in Covington County. Today, the Op City Schools Board of Education voted to hire the Luverne head football coach. He's the 29th coach in program history to lead the Bobcats on the field. His hiring comes just a week after first-year op head coach Matt Brunson chose to return to his former stumping grounds in Baker, Florida. Rigby, husband of Troy women's basketball head coach Shanda, comes to op with nearly 35 years of experience. It's a few months out from the start of fall camp for football teams around the Wiregrass, but some teams are still without some of the most important pieces of the puzzle, like Op Football, who is without a head coach until today. But today, Op announced a new man in charge. Longtime Wiregrass head coach Ed Rigby taking over for the Bobcats. Rigby has you coached in the Wiregrass since 2013, so most notably at Elba, where he won a state title in 2015, and Ufala, where he went 28-18 and 18 over a four-year stretch.